what is going on guys? I'm here with Mike and this is episode 2.5 of City Skylines. I, I recorded uh, an entire episode and realized that my mic was on mute. So that was super awesome. So what I'm going to do here for a minute, we're going to take a minute. I'll explain to you what we did with our city in the past 20 minutes and we'll jump back in to episode two and a half. So, all right. So let's just start here. Okay. So we became, we were a little hamlet in episode one. So we actually did quite a bit. We became a worthy village, 700 people. We are able to purchase a two by two kilometer area. So we can purchase another uh, block about the size of this one. We unlocked districts, policies, second loan industry, specialization services, policies, the fire department, police department, unique buildings, aggregate agriculture, specialization, forestry, so specialization, some policies uh, involving power usage, water usage, smoke detector, uh, detect uh, distribution. We have a firehouse unlocked, a police uh, station unlocked. We became a tiny town as well. We got decoration, level two unique buildings, pet bands, smoking bands. <laughs> Park and Recreation, and we unlocked a high school as well, and we are on our way to a boom town. Okay, so, um, as you can kind of see, we have some text over these areas. Those are our districts. We have the Underhill District, which I zoned. We can kind of look here. Here is Underhill District, and we have Amity Park. All right, so Amity Park, we haven't done anything with. I just, just that was the first one. Just, I was kind of showing you guys what the zones do. So you just kind of drag your zone out and whatnot. So now if we click on Amity Park with our policy, you can see we can apply different policies to this district. So, for example, power usage. Uh, moderately reduced electricity consumption, but it costs money per building. Different stuff like that. So, we took Underhill over here, which is our industry. And we, uh, we distributed some smoke detectors. Because um, uh, we did not have a fire station set up, and I did not want there to be any fires for the time being. Um, we got, I haven't even looked at these ones yet. Pet ban. Tired of watching your sept, uh, sept of what animal droppings. Banning pets is a sure way to get rid of that problem. So what this will do is slightly reduce garbage accum accumulation. Slightly decreased happiness, though. Smoking ban, uh, decreases happiness, decreases, or increases health. Parks and Rec increases decoration budget by 20%. Alright, so it will automatically, like, uh, I think, uh, implement more trees and whatnot. So we got that. Uh, we're actually gonna start... Oh, we only want on one, one speed for now. Um, so you can kind of see the ground is starting to turn purple around our district, or our uh, industrial uh, district. Uh, I heard a uh, siren. No fire? Huh. Okay. And what that is, just because there's a lot of ground pollution, you can see the trees are starting to change color. They're starting to die off a little bit. So what I did was I took our decoration. You can uh, place individual trees, and I kind of made a line of trees for a few reasons. It gives uh, these people a better view so they don't... <laughs> Alright, not really. It really didn't help that much. But instead of getting the direct vision of the nasty smoke industrial area, they have a nice line of trees blocking some of that vision uh, as well as it will stop the spread of the pollution. As you can kind of see, it will slowly push this back. Um, some of these trees will, will turn, but it will stop the spread for the time being. Yeah, look at, look at that little one. You're dying, man. You're dying, I know. Grow the city. Shh, man. I'm, give me a second, all right? Give me a sec. All right. So, we uh, we have a little bit more zoned area. I think this is my cutoff point. Uh, we're eventually going to have to spread this back as well. But uh, for the time being, I didn't really... I was just kind of trying to present some of this uh, pollution. We also put in a little bit of commercial here for uh, the people that don't want to drive all the way down here for a restaurant or to stop a loaf and whatnot. Okay, so we also have a police station, so crime is lowering, which is real good. Which is real good, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, fire house, so we got uh, fire coverage. Um, we also zoned, where is it? Where did I zone? We put in a nice elementary school for our people. For our people. Alright, so... What does tell us we need a more residential area? Oh yeah, also, if we come over here, we put in a nice, look at this coal plant, that's what I'm talking about. So, we do not have to worry about power for a little bit. We're using about half of our power consumption right now. So that's really, that's real good. Alright, so, we need some more residential. Uh, I'm gonna finish off this block here and we're gonna start spreading northwards, northbound. Um, let's get off of upgrade let's take this road and I don't think I'm gonna 
make any more. I really don't want many intersections. Low happiness? Low, look at that smiley face. That is not low happiness. Don't low happiness me, game. Alright, let's take this. Uh, take our nice road. And we're gonna bring this around. Around. How's that look? That looks pretty bad. Pretty bad indeed. At least that one does. Okay. So from here, what I can do is just kind of... No, 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 not from there. I'm going to come back from here. Zone this up. Zone this over here. I'm trying to make it, like, straight. That is not straight. You're, you're killing me, game. Alright, we don't have enough room for to do that. So we're going to just kind of cut that over. Like that. Bring this down. Bring this over. All right, that that'll that'll do. That will do. Um, doesn't look half bad. There's kind of a sharp edge there, but that's all right. And we kind of want to just maybe make one more little place like that. All right, that will work. Let's zone this residential area. Um, let's dezone that little area there. All right, we got little bit more we got a nice another cul-de-sac there hopefully these cul-de-sacs aren't going to like totally destroy how things run i'm hoping not so that, that'll add a little bit more we need a more uh, commercial too we can start zoning this side of the block and actually now that we have access here we can delete delete it there we go delete that as well delete 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 um power yeah, okay, cool. So we have power pretty much... Oh, we can delete that one too. Don't need that. Um, so we have... Oh, delete that too. So we have power to all this area, and everything's looking good. Let's make sure that I have water pipes underneath. Let's do that. And connect a little bit more there. Coo, coo, coo. Looking good. Looking good. Alright, so I'm tempted to buy this chunk first. So we want this chunk... Oh, dang. Actually, well, yeah, we're definitely going to pick up this chunk first. So if we click global. So this is kind of the overview of what you can purchase. I don't want to go this way because I want to keep the industrial. Ah. Hmm. The grid. We can do. I think I want to do. Can I turn? You cannot. You cannot turn. Okay. So I want to purchase these three here and then the three down here. I think. Yeah, because this will give us the train access here. Seven thousand dollars. That's actually not bad at all. Um, we have access to the train connections, ship connections, plane connections. Uh, we have what is this? Farming resources. Plenty of that. All right. So, and it also give us access to the uh, intersection part of the highway, so we can edit that as well. All right. So that, we're not gonna worry about that for now. Uh, we will delve into that at a late. Whoa. Okay. Never mind. I thought it was supposed to zoom in. Uh, at a later time. Alright, so we have $12,000. I really, really want to get this highway up and running before I expand too much. But, I I don't know. We don't have enough. We can take out a loan. But I don't really want to do that. Don't really want to do that. How much would it be? Weekly cost is 200 bucks. We're only making 800 though, a week. But it would give us 60 grand. That would definitely be enough to set up the highway. But, ah... Alright, alright, we're doing it, we're doing it. We're setting up the highway. We are doing it. Take out Global Credit Incorporated. Alright, so we're gonna pause this. Um, we are going to later, 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 later. Um, hopefully I didn't put... I, where is my... My clinic. Okay, neighborhood sh shop. So those are fine. We're gonna destroy those. Okay. Actually, we don't even have to destroy them. What we're going to do is this. So we are going to take... <sighs> we don't have enough population. So we are going to rebuild our road that we just demolished. That's what I'm talking about. That That is really prime. Really good. For some reason, I thought it was 1100 that we unlocked it. Not whatever the amount is that I thought it was. Dang. Alright, so let's go with this. Connect this straight down. Rebuilding, rebuilding this. Dang it. Man, I took out that nice big loan too. I am disappointed. 
I am disappointed. Okay, whoops, I accidentally made that. Alright, there we go. Okay, that's still ugly as can be. Alright, we're gonna get to 1,900 people before we do that. We kinda have to. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, people are moving in. People are moving in. So, what we're gonna do, I'll kind of explain it. So, we're gonna exp extend this out. We're gonna make an overpass. Have the highway come up and down. Have a, an exit leading here. We might actually just destroy... I don't know. Because this intersection won't be there. We could do, like... I don't know. We'll figure it out. Uh, if anything, we can just make this flat and have a nice couple turnoffs coming here and here and delete this bit of land, uh, road. Alright, so we got that. Uh, how's everything doing? Water's doing fine. Um, electricity's doing fine. It's starting to starting to get up there. Landfill use is 8%. We still have plenty of that. Uh, healthcare availability is prime. Uh, fire hazards down to 37%. That's pretty good. Usually uh, under 50s. Under 50s, acceptable. Crime rate 5. We're looking good there. We still need to put in a high school. Uh, I don't know. We could put in a high school here. Along this road. That wouldn't be bad. And that will start getting higher education people. We have 70,000 that we took out that giant loan. Um... You know what we're gonna do it. We have plenty of eligible people, eligible teens that need that need their uh, their path straightened. All right, so we got that. Uh, we're gonna expand um, Amity out a little bit more. Kind of place this like there. Bring it down. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, Amity Park looking good, looking real good. Uh, let's see, we actually have quite a bit of demand for commercial. Kind of place that there. Where's our D-Zoner? D-Zone. D-Zone. There we go. Place that there. And we can... For now, we're going to place that. This is pro These buildings are probably going to get deleted when we recreate, but that's okay. Bring this all the way down. Plenty of commercial. Plenty of commercial for everyone. Okay, so this actually... This doesn't look half bad, to be honest. I uh, wasn't too sure about it. Um... Probably not the most 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 orthodox way of doing it, but hey, you know it's gonna have to work. All right, how's everything looking over here? Industrial. We have zero industrial demand, which is good because I don't I I just don't want to zone industrial. It just looks nasty. It looks gross. Uh, let's see, where is this ore truck going? Right to the coal plant. Nice. All right, we got a we got a tractor here going to garments. That's agriculture apparently. Looks pretty agricultural. Alright. So, we actually still have some demand for residential. Uh, let's take a look here. Everything looks good. I think we want to zone in a park. I think it's time to put in a park. Uh, we have absolutely no nothing to do in this town. <laughs> um, oh yeah, so, uh, what's really cool about City Skylines is it has mod support. Uh, it also has cu custom content um, building. So I, uh, I checked out someone's map and it required the 2x4 parking lot. So when you see something like that, it's uh, it's custom content. So we could put down a parking lot. <laughs> but nah. Alright, so let's see what we got here. We got a small playground. Is it going to kind of give me a bit? No, it's not. You can kind of just open it up here. Children come here to play and adults relax and enjoy. We have a plaza with trees. Small park. How big are these? So it will take up quite a bit of land. Small park. Well, at least... But it will, can we even, I don't even think we have, or we can place it right there, and that's pretty much the only place. That's the problem with these, these wavy roads, is there, you can't really place up around it. Park with trees, that's pretty big, jeez. Uh, large playground. We have plaza with picnic tables. Botanical garden. And we have, maybe we'll just put like, in you know, a little basketball court. And a dog park. Maybe a, a basketball court court in a dog park um and we can put in a different kind of pathing so like we could space already occupied you can't connect it it's kind of upsetting what the heck space already occupied yeah i don't think you can uh connect it off of stuff dang that would have been really cool if you could connect it off the road, like have like a pathway uh, right off the sidewalk. That's uh, that's weird. Okay, so if we just kind of let's just see what this looks like. Okay, so it does it auto connects it. All right, so if we do something like that, can we 
place a park off of that, maybe? No, it has to be snapped to a road, it looks like. Yeah, alright, so that's alright, that's alright. So if we, we can actually place that there, and then we'll have it connected. That'd be kind of cool if you could create, like, your own little park area out of those roads. That's kind of, that, that would be pretty awesome. Um, where did it go? It was under the, this, okay. So, let's just kind of connect this to there so they have an alternative way of getting out. Oh, automatically add streetlights. That is way cool. I like that. That is a cool feature. Alright, so we have a nice uh, basketball court. We already got people playing on it. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. We got some nice land value now. Um, how is things looking? So it really didn't just gave people right around here. How about we put in a let's put in a dog park, and we can place that right, right. How about yeah, that looks good. Right on the edge of this cul-de-sac, so that'll make these people happy. Cool, we got a nice little. Oh, look at all the the different uh, different things I can do. That's awesome. That is awesome. We'll have to kind of look at maybe we'll maybe we'll put uh, download some custom content, see what people have created, and. Uh, maybe add some of that to our game that would be kind of cool all right so we have some residential demand we have medium demand for residential once again um i'm, I'm tempted to buy this and continue my my uh, amity park down in this area at least uh or should we just we're, we're, we'll eventually have to expand this way anyways so why not let's uh, let's get that going here we will just kind of create some flat Straight roads going through. Okay. Um, how do we want to do this? This is going to be a problem. I'm not going to zone anything along here. We can kind of bring this around like that. Because uh, that's going to uh, cause way too much noise pollution. These And that will just make everyone unhappy, which I really don't want. And we'll eventually have this road. I, I'm thinking go all the way across over here we might have another highway coming up as well we'll figure that out okay um, I'm trying to just do some early planning in our city uh, let's see so if we kind of do this as well let's go back to our straight road bring this up here now do I want to do I, I just I, I really like the way that that looks uh, we'll do something a little bit more orthodox than that though not such hard turns but I don't I don't I really just don't want to make it a blocky city uh, we'll kind of do something like like this this will be our main road going through okay I gotta be careful how close I get let's see here all right so we're probably actually gonna have to do little bit of reconfiguration. Luckily roads these roads are not too expensive. Um, once again, alright, so we're actually we're just gonna drop this straight down. Make it like a giant Ah, let's see here. So I was gonna make it a little bit more orthodox, but probably not actually. Do something like that. Okay. And then what are you doing up here? Get out of here. Get out of here, man. Alright, actually, that, all right, that'll that work. And then we'll just kind of do some back roads, maybe. Like, as long as the intersections aren't configured, like, screwing up the others, I think we'll be alright. And then we can just kind of do something like that. Alright, that doesn't look half bad. That does not look half bad. And we have, wow, the demand is so insane. That is crazy how fast it's going up. And let's just zone all this in. Let's add a little bit of commercial, maybe right this block here. We have our marquee. That block and that block will be commercial. And then we'll fill the rest of this in with uh, residential. Cool. Oh, oh yeah, we need to add uh, some water, some piping. Good morning, everybody. What a beautiful sunrise. Paradise on Earth. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. We have this kind of like utility road here that we'll have to do something with eventually. Just kind of zone this all. Really orthodox. Really orthodox. <laughs> Alright. Hey, no one sees it. No one sees it. It's fine. Look at, look at that piping system. That's all I'm talking about. Real engineer work. Alright, so our, our residential is going down. Um, so we're actually, technically, this was episode 3. 
Uh, sorry about that. Uh, I'm using new recording software. Oh, well, actually, I got no excuse for that. My mic was muted. But, <laughs> anyways, guys, uh, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to leave a like. It really does help. Uh, let's shoot for 10 likes. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, 10 likes. And that's a new show. Thank you.